806. I'm coming off Hidden Peak. The wind was so bad, I just couldn't get warm. So I figured it was, it was prudent to uh, wait out the night where I could find some shelter by the Hidden Peak structure. of the American Fork Twins in Red Baldy. Eleven twenty-two. Top Red Baldy. Over there's the Bastard Sun, the Ameri for American Fork Twins, and Red Top. Next we have White Baldy in the distance.
Just short of one o'clock on the summit of White Baldy. Coming over from Red Baldy. And on the summit ridge. Next, on to the Pfeiffer Horn. Two fifty at the second cache, midway between White Baldy and the Pfeiffer Horn. The descent off White Baldy took quite a while longer than expected. Pfeiffer Horn should be reasonably fast and straightforward. Fifty-three. Took a bit of a longer break at the cache. Put everything together and so I was kind of tired. Long ways coming over from White Baldy to the summit of the Pfeiffer Horn. In the beginning of the beat out. Next we have some Wapta Peak, Chipman Peak, South Thunder, Upper Bells, and Lone. And then we're done. Fourteen tops in Wapta Peak after a traverse over from the Pfeiffer Horn. Now Almost 520, the top Chipman Peak. Came over from White Baldy, the Pfeiffer Horn, and Sunwapta Peak. Now we have South Thunder Mountain, and then the finale of Upper Bells and Lone Peak. Summit Alone Peak at 9.51. Now time for the long hike back.